Some cats don't have it so easy. And this picturesque setting on the Aegean Sea does not guarantee an idyllic existence. On an island off the shore of Athens, stray cats live in colonies. Introduced by pirates who occupied the port until the 19th century, their population has exploded in the absence of predators. But their scarred little faces show the harsh reality hidden behind the postcard setting. Here, we see a little ginger orphan. Skinny and weak, the kitten must struggle to survive. It's undernourished and doesn't fare well during the cool nights of early autumn. Nearby, three luckier kittens play fight while the little ginger kitten looks on. One of them is even agile enough to climb a tree and attempt to hunt for food. The reason this trio is more robust than our ginger kitten is that their mother is around to watch over them and provide them with food. Mother Cat makes the rules. She rations out her milk by feeding them in turns. Elsewhere, they would be too old, but here their mother's milk is often the only source of nutrition. This one has gone blind in one eye, an infection caused by malnutrition. For the mother, it's also a struggle to find enough to eat. Leaving the kittens in a safe place, she heads out in search of food, whatever the weather. The survival of her family depends on it. At the port, she waits for just the right moment. Salvation comes from the sea. Over the decades, the fishermen have grown accustomed to the cats and have become, in a way, their guardian angels. But Mother Cat is not the only one with the same idea. Every time a boat comes in, an amazing spectacle takes place. The entire colony of stray cats gathers to take advantage of the fish that are either too small or damaged to keep. Like tigers, cats are often solitary. Stray animals only tolerate their fellow creatures near food sources.
the biggest males are always served first. Low in the hierarchy, the black female must wait until the dominant cats have had their fill. <laughs> While the tomcats feast, Mum finally manages to get her share. She eats her meal and even manages to bring back a little for her kittens. High up on the island, the kittens are lured from their hiding place by the smell of fish. Since they will soon be weaned, this familiarizes them with dead prey. It's a way of stimulating their instinct before they learn to hunt for themselves. The ginger kitten is hesitant and timid. He's afraid, but he's also hungry. Finally, the one-eyed kitten lets him have what's left. The kittens don't have the silky fur and round tummies of well-fed kittens. But it looks like the shared feast has perked up the little ginger kitten and he's now accepted by the three siblings. <laughs>